late 1600s, early 1700s? 400 years later, you guys are sitting in a classroom in Cleveland, Tennessee, and you think Humpty Dumpty is an egg. And you know why? Because of one picture. That's the power of the pictures, right? 400 years later, you all think this guy's an egg because some guy decided to draw a picture. Isn't that interesting? So this is why the pictures are so important to what you do because they stick with you, right? What is the crisis in your story? All right? Think about it. Humpty falls off the wall. Do we know why Humpty falls off the wall? No, you better give us a reason. Maybe a bird yeah. picked in his eye and freaked out. No. <laughs> You've got to give me a reason. So do we know why Jack fell down the hill? No, maybe Jill saw him with another girl. She pushed him. OK? You better give me a reason. So come up with a crisis, and then the rest of the story writes itself. Once you know the crisis, all you have to do is get your character to the crisis. Okay, if Humpty Dumpty's falling off the Empire State Building because he's taking a selfie, right? Okay, <laughs> so there's your crisis. So now you gotta tell me why he's going to the Empire State Building. Let's go take some pictures, right? That's easy. Then you've gotta clean up the mess at the end, right? So once you get the crisis down, the rest of it's a piece of cake. Got it? All right. This is a tightrope walker and he's walking on the tightrope to another building where his friend is and his friend is being dumb and she takes a picture with the flash on and it blinds him and he wobbles a little bit but he's fine until the cord snaps and then he falls and now he's in a full body cast and his friend is telling him not to be stupid and do things on the internet. <laughs> Jack and Jill went up the hill until Jack got hit by a wrecking ball. Jack went, Jack went, went to the hospital. Jack left the hospital. Jack turns into the Hulk. Jack like Jill. And, then, and Jack goes to jail because Jill told the police. <laughs> What you enjoyed about Mrs. White's presentation today? Hunter. You basically get to like play what you want to. Okay, so I'm not telling you what to do. You're coming up with the idea. Yes. Awesome. awesome. Um, you get to like draw your own animation. It's like when you draw it, you can have like whatever you like in it. It's just like animation that you come up with and like you don't have to have ideas from other people. Good, I love that. Tito. I like new things. Yeah. New things, love that. Isaac. Out of the ordinary. Out of the ordinary. Dominique. Fun. It doesn't have to be perfect. Doesn't have to be perfect. And by the way, we really have to work on fun because you know we don't want any fun in here. It's actually pretty cool because you get to draw whatever you want. Get to draw whatever you want? It's different. Different. It's mythical. Say that again. It's mythical. Mythical. Yes. And you don't have to do an essay. It's another way of expressing yes. yourself. So what can we take? Let's call. Let's all shout in one word. Awesome. One, two, three. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs>